I guess I will keep this Reaper. It's really bad if he's aggro druid though. I'll play this on turn two with Power Word Shield. Yeah, and then there's all this information about like development and cortexes and stuff like that, and it's like you know, maybe those are things that I'm not even factoring in. Because I don't know that information. <laughs> Let's save the girl. She's important. Let's draw a card first. Though. Right away. Cards are good. I love cards. Cards, 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 cards. Why don't you run Lyra? Because I am a combo deck that tries to kill my opponents with my combo, and being such the requirements for that deck. I want things that remove my opponent's minions to make sure I don't die. I want things that draw cards from my deck so I can find my combo. And I want cards that are my combo. And Lyra doesn't fit in any of those three categories. So it does not make the cut in the deck. After UIs, we do that. Tackle man. Bring the pain. What's your opinion on the Chinese man on tourism to North Korea and how does it affect your future arsenal content? I haven't heard of that, but it seems like tourism in North Korea would be difficult. I don't think it's really going to affect me though. Typically in this matchup against the Jadrid, even though the Kazakis for one here looks super appealing, you want to get Kazakuses for 10 or Kazakis for 5 in the mid game that swings the board a lot. If I can get a 10, then I can have like a full clear with Anduin and a full clear with that, which can really buy me a lot of time to build my combo. So, that's something I'm looking forward to trying to do. For now, I want to find pain to get through that potentially. Or what? What else could help me? There's not too much else that could help me. Okay. I think I take my card. I don't want to miss a card for sure, but it's kind of scary with an Echolite in play. He could overdraw me, so I think I'll just take my one. So overdraw is... It's this way, to overdraw me he needs to earn the ring for or something. I've already used pain. That would make it difficult to find. I don't want to pain these anyway, they're fine. They'll get caught up in AoE. Nine. It's still only three, six, nine, ten, eleven pressure. Eleven's not a lot. It's a manageable degree of pressure. Might use Smite to clear something, but Smite is a good damage source for finishing the game. So I want to save it if I can. So it's a different play. Seven spells. Let's investigate this. That'll be good. Now I'll have Endwin and Raza. So if he doesn't kill me really quickly, I should be able to just control the board with that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. UI me, bro. Not a UI. Shuffling first, then UI. Okay. Innervate, man. What you got, Rio? That's a lot more pressure. The hero power damage is real, man. It's no joke. He armored up. Interesting. Playing puts that out. We can stabilize a board against him. I've seen it before. So if we can actually... We need to get a Kazakus for 10 that's gonna clear and... Or just generate a shitload of stuff. So that we can push extra with it. So at some point we need to do that. Three, six, seven, eight. Why not now? Oh, overdraw. What else am I playing this turn? I could probably just flash heal myself. It's better flash heal myself than I use the Priest of the Feast, I think. Uh oh. None of these are summoned. I could go for the Dream Summon and just take this, but I think I'll take the safe route and cheap. 
Okay. We're gonna need to do demons, otherwise we're gonna run out of damage this game if he armors every turn. Okay. Dr. Bones just subscribed for 10 months in a row. Welcome back to Back Ave Team Thing, man. Appreciate the support. 40 life. The man has HP. Alright. 45 life. It's okay. We're priest. And we're a silly deck. A very silly deck. We won't want to do that yet. It's interesting because if we don't do it, though, we waste a lot of damage. So I think we actually do want to do it. Even though it's premature. Two swipes the left, too. It's a little scary since so chip damage is annoying. 22 is not the pinnacle of health. Or 27. But I'm afraid of his armor total. Holy shit. This man has a plan! <laughs> and it's pretty good! 51. It's gonna be a 54. I didn't get a summon, but we could become, like... I don't know. Oh my god. We have one, two, five spells left. One of them's Mind Blast. We probably want double Mind Blast this game. Ah, This would be the most damage, but not necessarily the most useful. I think it's best. Missed the Mind Blast with five spells left. That's rough. That is rough. He still has the swipe so he can kill Mr. Villain. Eventually, Valen may stick. But he is at 46, and we can do 40 in one turn eventually. 
So we're in striking distance ish. One swipe is gone and two wraths are gone. So he has to face tank Velen if we play. Both swipes are gone. So now he can't kill Velen unless he has something on the board. So we can get a stable Velen out. Because he only has Feral Rage and Hero Power. So we're going to silence that and kill him with Velen. Because he can't kill it now. Unless he runs Innervades. So. This seems. Not all are lost. Unless he has, like, naturalize. I don't know. I'm gonna use this in case he has silence. But even if he silences it, he's played both Jade Behemoths, so it's a 7 7 that gets to punch him in the face, which would be nice. We can get there. Our tangled web. He's Scary. Uh oh. I'm casting spells now. This is at the start of my next turn. Next turn, not this turn. I don't know. Does it might the tre that might have just killed everything? The treachery corrupting mist. Did that kill everything? Yep. Wow, treachery corrupting mist cleared. What a god. That's okay. That's a good card to mill. I hope you like my invention. No, oh, it's supposed to be silence. The master Let Ed know, so he'll check this game out. I can rest now. So we'll put that bad boy on YouTube. 